Well, what happened, son? Uh, the radiator didn't What's up, YouTube? Back at you guys with another video. Today, we're going to be trying to get the uh, transmission filled up, put the new dipstick in. Well, the old dipstick in. But we'll probably clean it up and paint it and get ready to see how much fluid we got in there. I don't want to paint it until we get ready to throw it in. So, I'm going to show y'all what we got going on. And we'll get right into this video right after this intro. Peace. Alright guys, y'all see I got the dipstick right here. I don't know what I did with that rag. There it is. But I cleaned it up real good. Look at all that stuff came off. I cleaned it up real good guys so I'm gonna get it put in there and uh, I'm not gonna bolt it down because I just want to see how much fluid in there um, it's gonna be kind of hard to hold the camera and do this but I think it's about right there yeah I'm gonna have to go under and see what we got going on Cause I do got some wires and stuff right there. So let me get it lined up guys. All right. See all these wires I got going everywhere. And let me see what I can show you how to plug. The plug is right there. Man, I'm gonna need a new camera after all this work. Keep dragging this expensive camera up under here. But we gotta, we gotta grind, guys. We gotta grind. So let's see how this is going. No, I don't sit like that. It's gotta be turned the other way. Turn. Come on. I don't move as soon as I turn the camera on. It ain't gonna wanna act right. Come on. Golly. Hold on, guys. Okay, guys, I got it in there and it's gonna bolt to the top of the transmission. Y'all ain't gonna be able to really see. Let me see if y'all can see. But I'll point to it. But right, right there, behind that red wire. Let's see. It's going to bolt right there. So, anyways, I'm not going to bolt it down. Let's just see. We got oil in there. Pull it back up. And, yep drained it all so that's cool what we'll do we'll go ahead and go grab some uh, transmission oil and we'll get it filled up all right let's see how far this get us and this stuff ain't cheap we got my brother on the ones and twos oh yeah so put you on camera first <laughs> yeah all right <laughs> he like I'm good. <laughs> That's how I was at first. Now I don't care. <laughs> Is he like me or you don't like me? You can go to another channel. <laughs> nah, a lot of y'all real cool though, man. I met a lot of cool people on my little YouTube journey. Now we get into the money. So on this car, well, on these motors, the trans cooler runs in with the uh, transmission. So we got to put the new lines on and hook up the transmission. You don't have to plug up the uh, 
the cooling lines, but you, you do have to run that transmission. So we're just gonna see where this gonna put us. I think it called for like 20 quarts. Well, we're just gonna see. Should be pretty close. Yeah. I keep looking down there, waiting for a leak. <laughs> <laughs> I should have bolted it down. You push it in, I Huh? Pushed it in, yeah, Daddy. Yeah, yeah, I pushed it in. Should have been it. I should have bolted it down. Now. It leaked a little bit, but it's it's in there though. Unless we fool. It's leaking. Good now. I might be going too fast though. Got this big old funnel. Uh oh. Alright guys, we're gonna check it. We'll turn y'all back on in a minute. Well, I'm back from the auto parts store and it is dark now. But on this channel, we got to show the good with the bad, guys. So, y'all see that leak right there? I didn't know. I ain't never did a dipstick on a, a 4L60. So, I put the dipstick in, and I'm like, well, what is wrong with this thing? Felt a little loose, but I went ahead and filled it up, and that happened. So, it's got a seal that goes on there. Focus. That's the part number right there. 760014. And these are like a dollar. So what I'm going to do off camera, pull that out. Hope I don't get soaked. And uh, we're going to put that seal on there. I'm going to finish filling it up. And we might start on the rest of this tomorrow. Because we got to put the radiator in and run the transmission lines. So, a little update right there. We'll see where we get. Woo! Got it in there, guys. Y'all see it right there? The seal is in. So now, I'm going to try to fill it up and see what it does. I hate transmission oil. Stinks. Yeah, all that. You did waste a little bit. Now what guys? Let me get a check on it. Let me get a check before we go too far. We'll check it. This the part I don't like. I like having fun. This part ain't fun. Man, we got oil everywhere. So 
So this is what we're gonna do. This probably got too much. I don't know. <clears throat> but what we're gonna do, guys. Hope y'all can see me. What we're gonna do. We're gonna plug up the transmission lines and radiator and then we're gonna run it. Well, what happened, son? Uh, the the radiator what? The radiator didn't fit. Yep, so we got a big problem on our hands, guys, right now. <sighs> we can't turn the transmission and fill up everything. Because the radiator don't fit. This the bracket right here to there. I should have checked that too, man. Golly. Bracket to there to there. So we out of luck there. Let's see, uh, see what we can order tomorrow. And uh, y'all already know the routine. We will see y'all in, in the next video. video. Peace.